Hello guys, this is Emmanuel from WindowsReport.com. In this video, we're going to talk about an error from Windows 10 and Windows 8.1. I think most of the user at some point got this error. So this error sounds something like this. Your computer is low on memory. We're going to go through some solutions and some advices in this video that hopefully will help you to solve this problem. First of all, we have to talk about viruses. This error can come up because of the viruses that infected your PC. So don't worry, check out the article down below, you'll have there some links and you'll be able to scan your PC for viruses and for other errors to see if some kind of infection is on your PC. So after you clear that up and you see that no infection is on your PC, you have to be careful in the task manager. To access the task manager, right click on your taskbar and click on task manager. Here in task manager, you'll have to click on the processes tab and here you'll always be able to see the memory usage. As you can see, on my part the memory usage is um, approximately at 40%. So your memory usage could be higher, maybe close to 100% and that is what causes the error. So to solve that, you have to go through these apps. Here are all the apps that are running currently on my PC and your PC, of course. You have to see if there are apps running that you are not using at the moment and you should close them in order to release the RAM memory. If you wanna see a more detailed task manager, uh, maybe you wanna see the application that uses the most RAM memory, you have to click on details tab and here you have to click on memory of physical memory in use and as you can see task manager will categorize your apps by the ones that use the most memory so you can see what apps are running you can close the apps that are not useful for you or the apps that you are not using at the moment and you should be okay another solution to this problem would be to check your system using the Windows troubleshooter the Windows troubleshooter isn't always the best solutions for errors in Windows but this troubleshooter is one of the best in this case because the Windows troubleshooter is designed to solve the most common Windows problems. So to access it, you have to click on the search icon and in the search icon, you'll have to write in troubleshooting. You click on troubleshooting and then in the window that appears, you have to click on view all. And from this list, you'll have to look for the system maintenance. You click on system maintenance and then you click on next and Windows will run the process of troubleshooting your PC. Also the most important solution is this last one. So you should try to increase your virtual memory. So if you don't know what virtual memory is, virtual memory is a part of your RAM memory that stays unused for some time and it is used only if necessary, only if the Windows sees that the RAM usage is too high. So if you increase that virtual memory, you should get rid of the error message. So to increase your virtual memory, you'll have to press Windows plus X and then click on system. In this window, you have to click on advanced system settings. Then you have to make sure that you're on the advanced tab. And then in the performance section, you have to click on settings. You have to click on the advanced tab again and you'll see here a section that is called virtual memory. You have to click on change and uncheck the automatically manage paging file size for all drives and then you can set your own virtual memory size by clicking on custom size. So you have to put here a value that is let's say a bit higher than the recommended one and you should be okay. Then you press okay and you'll see that you have to make a restart your PC in order for the changes to take effect. Your PC will restart and your problems should be solved. So guys, those were the best methods to apply when you're dealing with your computer is low on memory Windows error. You should also consider in expanding your RAM memory of course, but if the problem is solved everything is okay. If you enjoyed this video and this video was helpful don't forget to leave a like until next time i was emmanuel from windowsreport.com bye bye